Dear viewers, I hope you are all fine. This ultrasound video shows a case of enlarged mesenteric lymph nodes in a child of about three and a half years. Enlarged lymph nodes, abdominal lymph nodes, are frequently encountered in asymptomatic children and should not always be considered abnormal. Enlarged lymph nodes exceeding 10 mm in their shortest axis in children with abdominal pain may represent mesenteric lymphadenitis of various causes. Now you can see the area of scanning is right iliac fossa and multiple prominent lymph nodes are seen in this area. Sonograph of normal mesenteric lymph nodes shows that they are over with a prominent fatty hilum. You can see the large lymph nodes, mesenteric lymph nodes. For the most part, the lymph nodes tend to swell as a standard response to infection. They may also swell due to stress. Some of the most common illnesses associated with swollen lymph nodes includes include colds, ear infections, the flu, tonsillitis, skin infections, or glandular fever. Now again you can see the large lymph nodes. Now the, the question arises, what size is in large lymph nodes? Lymph nodes are generally considered to be normal if they are up to 1 cm in diameter. However, some authors suggest that epitrochlear lymph nodes larger than 0.5 cm, that is half cm, or iguanal lymph nodes larger than 1.5 cm should be considered abnormal. Little information exists to suggest that a specific diagnosis can be made on node size. Lymph nodes in the neck, armpit, or groin are close to the surface of the skin and are very easy to see and feel. Others such as those deep inside the abdomen, that is stomach or chest, cannot be felt from the outside. So the causes of the swollen lymph nodes are various causes. When more than one area of lymph nodes is swollen, it is called generalized lymph adenopathy. Some infections such as strep streptococcus, th throat and chicken pox, certain medicines, immune system diseases and cancers like lymphoma and leukemia can cause the, this kind of swelling, generalized swelling. The most common causes of mesenteric lymph adenitis is viral infection such as gastroenteritis, often called stomach flu. The infection causes inflammation in the lymph nodes in the thin tissue that attaches the intestine to the back of the abdomen, abdominal wall, that is mesentery. Mesenteric lymph nodes are considered to be enlarged when their short ax axis was 8 mm or more, although 3 mm has previously been used as an upper limit for the short axis diameter of mesenteric lymph nodes. Up to 39% of healthy normal patients have larger lymph nodes than this. Now you can see the multiple lymph nodes, prominent and slightly enlarged.
Mesenteric lymph and lymphadenitis is likely more common in acute appendicitis in the first decades of life. Acute appendicitis becomes more frequent in the second decade, whilst while the mesenteric lymph and lymph and adenitis is distinctly uncommon after the age of 20 years. You can find some important information in the description of this video. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe my channel. If you do like this video, please click the like button. Thanks.